Cut. I think I have some guests. Hi, welcome back to Spine Gaming. Let's make sure this is actually set back. Hello, come in. Okay. Hey, I got uh, Chief Day out here. He's coming in with me, okay? Uh, sure. Well, I'm wearing clothes. Okay. That's the start, right? Uh huh. All right. Well, I'll come in. Then. <laughs> come in, no. Just Stop sitting out there. <clears throat> The door handle helps. Oh. Okay. You, 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 uh, you open it and then you then you push. Blosser up just can manage this. Come on, you got it. No, I I got it. Um, Chief got a phone call. He's he'll stop ah, again when he gets sick. <sighs> hi. Oh hi. <laughs> yeah. So here we are once again. <laughs> I see. Uh, okay. Yeah. So I already dropped everything, and I have the rest of the day off hand tomorrow. I'm well, not dying. Because the fact all I heard anymore. was, "Oh, well, this is what I was told. I was in the middle of teaching a class, and I had some random ass kid come barging through in and go, oh, Sheriff Riley's not breathing and on her way to the hospital after an accident.' So, uh, it turns out so... I'm a little allergic to bees, and by a little I mean a lot. Wait, what? Well, I've never been stung by one before. Okay. You know, I always read about it, I saw it on TV, and thought, you know what, I'd love to try that. And apparently I did, whilst driving at 70 miles an hour. And my body didn't react particularly well to this. I decided that yes. oxygen was sub superfluous to my needs, and vision was, you know, excessive, so... Hold on, so you got stung while you were driving? Yeah. What? Uh, I was driving into the in city to... to get ready for my shift and I apparently rolled the car a couple of times and ended up in a ditch beside the freeway. I was not hugely hurt from that because I was basically unconscious at the time but I stopped breathing, everything swelled up and yeah not a great particular time Okay, well, I mean for being in an accident you look great so I don't know if that's a compliment or not like I said, I was but, good at ragdolling you... in the car, so seat belts and airbags did yeah. their jobs. Okay, a couple of bruises you... and some scrapes and cuts, but in grand scheme, I'm okay. Now my ribs okay. all hurt. I've pulled muscles from trying to breathe too hard. And my lungs are somewhat inflamed and sensitive, but yeah. All right. Um, I mean, how are you feeling? Tired. Very, very tired. And I want to get out of here. Uh, oh, I have a concussion, too. I forgot about that. Probably because I have a concussion. That sounds about right, doesn't it? Wow, well, yeah. It's yeah. I'm not going to lie to you, it does. Yeah, okay. so so I, I hit my head as well. No, I, I, I... They said they're ready to sign me out at some point soon, so that'll be good, I guess. I just... Yeah. Okay. Feeling um, exhausted and drained and like I've just been run through a tumble dryer. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, that's pretty. Yeah, I mean, you woke up and you were, or actually, no, did in you ambulance. Up in the scene? You woke up in the ambulance. Yeah, I, I, apparently, I was semi-conscious on the scene, but I, I already could have came to in the ambulance, okay. which isn't uncommon for me to wake up in an ambulance. So I wasn't that scared. That should be okay, bad, well. shouldn't it? It's a 50-50. I'll, I'll, yeah. I'll be honest. It's 50-50. That's <sighs> what it is. Okay. Um, here. I'm going to go find... Okay. Nice real quick. Okay. Just grab the paperwork. Did you bring those clothes? I think... Yes, I did. No, Thank you. Um, sorry. Um, let me go grab that for you real Thanks. quick. Thanks. Okay. Oh. Oh. Hang on. Assume Chief Day's out there somewhere? I don't know. He might be. Yes. Here's it. No, here's oh, the. Oh, thank uh, you. Thank closer. you. Okay. Oh, 
and here, get ready. Do you need a hunt? Yeah. You got it? I got you. Just set yeah. up and slide over. Yeah, I will. You good? Yeah. Ow. Okay. Easy. I got you. Yeah, I, yeah, just, it's, it's difficult, you know? And I just, I just feel like I've been for a long run and I feel drained and exhausted and bruised. It's a weird feeling, not remembering why I'm in pain, but I am. Okay. I'm mostly mobile, though, I think. Well, I'm gonna sit down again finish. for a minute. Yeah, just finish getting ready. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go grab the nurse so that way she can sign the okay. paperwork now. Yeah. And then I think the chief may or may not be getting off this call. I've heard some yelling in the okay. hallway, but okay. I'll, I'll double check and then, mm -hmm. yeah, I'll, yeah. Good idea. Hey, hey. Hi. Not here for my job feeling? already, are you? No, not yet. <laughs> you still have another couple of weeks. Uh, yeah, so far I've won every real action that's happened. Nothing like I don't know. If I run, you might have a... If I try, you might have a run for your money. Don't you have a department to worry about? Not right now. Or ladders? Okay, just because we have more people fall off ladders does not make it a wise problem. You have more problem. people fall off ladders than state issues tickets. That's not true. Mm. We've only had seven accidents this month. Yeah. <laughs> to be fair, that's a record for you guys. Mm -hmm. it's, yeah, honestly, it's normally like 15. So I'm happy. And, you know, to be fair, it's normally this one officer. So normally. I'm not really. You're right? Yeah, no, a little sore. <laughs> Been through a bit of a ringer. Yeah, a little bit. Stung by a Jeez. bee. Or TLDR, stung by a bee. Turns out I'm very allergic. Uh, anaphylactic shock. Uh, lost consciousness, car rolled a couple of times. Yeah, uh, why am I hearing this from outside parties and not receiving like a text or phone know. call directly? Uh, this is this is a shame. Maybe you you did? I don't know. I'm pretty sure it would have gone after no, the radio. I I guarantee, I guarantee I haven't done anything. Hold on. I gotta. I heard from one of the nurses that the fire department were very confused on scene for most of the time, so I might have died. Can you please not? I don't intend yeah. to, darling, but at the same time, just, they got very not... confused. Yeah, Apparently, they thought I was turning happen. blue because I, I was dangling from my seatbelt, not because of anaphylactic shock at all. I did get a phone right call there, from blue. an unknown. Huh. Maybe. I don't care. <sighs> did the nurse want to sign me out yet, or...? Yeah, I, I got the clipboard here. Just Wonderful. go ahead. I'm going to slide this to you. Just sign okay. the bottom of it, and then we can go. Oh, you're leaving? Yes, I want to get out of here as soon as possible. I, I, should we go somewhere? Because I'm perfectly happy to do that. I just wanted to be here. I'm sick of hospitals. I, mean, I want out as soon as I can. We get that coffee shop right down the road. That's new if you guys want to go there. Better than oh, hospital no coffee. So yeah, I'm down. Yeah, it, not the uh, not the uh, bean machine, but there's the. Uh, I'm sorry, the. Uh, what is that one the firefighters run? Uh, anyway, there's one right down the street. There's another. Oh, one. the Crucial um. Flex. Yeah, this bean yeah, machine yeah, just opened one. up. Yeah, the bean awesome. machine is over. So. Alright, looks like I have to yeah, use this I'm stupid down. thing. Get me out of here before they change their minds. Alright, you able to walk okay or no? You need me to wheel da, you da, out. Da, 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 please, please wheel her out. Well, you know they don't like people to actually leave the hospital unless they're wheeled out for insurance purposes, I right? I, yeah, I'm fully aware, but at the same time, I don't want to get beat over the head because, you know... I'm not going to beat you over the head much. We'll be fine. Okay. Roll me over. Roll over. I will promise not to run you over. Right. These doors are a little trickier than single doors. I'll do a wheelie if you're not careful. Please don't do a wheelie. Hey, if that's how I got wheelchairs, it'll be great. I heard there's an Olympics like that. There is, yeah. And they do like basketball and netball and stuff. It's amazing. Yeah, 230's competed. That wouldn't surprise me. You know, at time Dorothy's hurt. There we go. And then we go. Oh, oh, ah. oh, don't fall over. Careful, I think they just oh, you'll uh, be the mopped too. the floor there, Chief. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Uh, since I'm on the curb, I get to get out of this stupid thing. Ah, uh, screw that. Right. Uh. Easy. Now, here's, here's the real question, okay? Yeah. We can run down, grab the car, bring it around, or we can go down three flights of stairs. 
I think I can manage some stairs if you want to make sure I'm not going to okay. fall over. I, I got you. That works perfectly. I'm here for moral support. I'm not catching you. Wow. I'll Choo -choo. remember that next time you get shot. You can call me by my first name, you know. I feel like that's Bobby, I will call you anything in right. many I, I meant him mainly because I saw him in the lobby. He's like, oh, hey, chief. I'm like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but Sorry, it was it's... weird for him to call you by your first name. Me, yeah. not so much. Him, he's an underling. This is how it works. I mean, he is inferior. Yeah. Wow. You darling, you don't hold the same rank as us. It's fine. Oh, I... Uh... <laughs> Ow. Uh, I think I tried to breathe so hard, I've definitely bruised some muscles between the ribs. Uh, but thankfully I didn't break any bones, probably purely by luck and mostly because yeah, I was yet. darling in the car. Oh, Don't tell me that pink thing is yours, why is it Bobby? It's a seizure vehicle. A seizure got on vehicle as in look at it and gives you a seizure? No, I got it from a guy who killed somebody. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, it was seized, and then the state was auctioning it off, because what are we going to use huh. it for? And I stole it for, like, it was like four grand. Awesome. Fair enough. That's not a terrible deal. It's it's not that bad. I mean, it, it kind of hurts to get in and out of. She's got to, like, duck down yeah, really I far. Yeah, I will stick to the charger for now. Oh, God. I suppose we'll see you over there? Yep. It sounds wonderful. Oh, and hydraulics. It's so very you, really Bobby. Yeah, thanks. I don't think I actually close it manually. We should probably go with an inside venue now, is what you're saying, right? Maybe, yeah. Or at least, no bees. <laughs> I mean, now it's good as long as we keep them away and maybe have an army of beekeepers. I'm down for the army of beekeepers. Well, I mean, the... there's a couple of them that are outside, that are away from bees, so there's a plus. There you go, that'd work. Oh, God. Why do I keep doing this? <laughs> oh, I feel rotten. Come in. No, you I go to the hospital. No, yeah, I, I hate being in the hospital. And once again, I've, my body's for another reason to get me back in there. If it's not, you know, an allergy to bullets, it's an allergy now to bloody bees. Hey, you had no clue on that. Don't hold that over. My entire head. life, I've just never been stung by one. Everyone's afraid of getting stung by a bee, but no one ever actually worries that he might be deathly allergic. So now I'm allergic to heights, to bees, to bullets, to knives, cars. There's a long list. I love how he's not even waiting for us. Ow. Just a little, little doddery. Look at him, just wandering off, not a care in the world. Uh, he's still getting used to the socialness of things. Yeah. I've heard he's even been seeing someone. I'll have to probe him on that. Yeah. Oh yeah, he told you. I mean, yeah, he told me just now. Hmm. Okay. Mr. Forever Alone finally isn't. Oh, well, we'll see. Now we just need to keep the nice mistake commissioner going. away from barn animals and we should be okay. on that problem, unfortunately. Mm, Nothing to join us, Bobby. What are you talking about? They're running off without us. Why are they waiting for you? Right here. I mean, not really. Not really. I'm gonna jaywalk. Uh, wow, I should arrest you for this. I also arrest feel I should, in my me? condition, be walking across the road without waiting for the green light because my, my odds aren't fantastic. They last two seconds anyway. No, we seem to have survived somehow. Is it is is that the door or is it 
the one over here. here. They're both of them for doors, you know. Yeah, they, they have handles, um, they're doors. Usually they're mounted on hinges. Okay, so okay, wood, okay, glass, okay, okay, okay. You tend to push them, pull them, you open the you handle, back, or grab the bar, and then seat. in you go, and it's wonderful, see? I want a beam machine. I'll help Hi. you guys over here. I need it side, so y'all can go. I will have a hazelnut latte, please. Large. And what kind of milk would you like in it? Uh, soy, please. Hot or cold? Uh, hot. No, wait. Gotcha. All right, is that all for you guys? Uh, no, I'm gonna take a large coffee. Uh, I'm gonna get ya. You can get the no coffee. No cream. Uh, let's do two sugars. Less you than two or two sugars? No, just two. Okay. All right, Please, now I'm sir. going to. Yep, a cappuccino, please. All right, just a uh, beer. Is it, uh huh? J just, just a cappuccino. Yeah. All right, yeah. that all for you. Oh, yes. cozy. All right, can I have a name for it? Uh, Bobby. Bobby. All right, Bobby, your toes gonna come to. <laughs> okay. I'll, I'll take. I'm paying. Um, no, I'm oh, this is definitely got some I, uh, some I, I friends. Not you. quite, but you know what? I'll go with it. Yeah, I'm away. Pretend it's Central Park. It's oh, not yeah, blocked. Yeah, sure you do. Dude. I'm gonna tell you the total. It's gonna try to get you go through a tip option before you can pay. Um, the total is gonna be um eighteen ninety six. And it's gonna be those two white arrows in the middle right there. No tips in the bottom. It's just the green circle to accept. Um, once you do, would you like your find receipt? a new one? He sucks. Ah, uh, he's he's got some redeeming features. Okay. I heard you found uh, a new one. Thank you. Do tell. Yeah, just one second, okay? Yes. No worries, um, I was actually telling you. I have about, heard you've been dating. About him. Yeah. Him. We're, we're going steady. I heard it was we're a girl. going steady. I need to... no, it's a him. You sure? I need to uh <laughs> I'm I'm pretty positive. The short haired brunette? Yeah. I'm pretty sure I've seen them. Work out of station yeah, seven, no, right? It's, it's a guy. It's a guy, it is? yeah. Oh. Yeah. Is it? Oh, yeah. Apparently it's a guy. Like is it a guy like Dalton cool. is a guy? is it No, it's it's or is a guy. It different? It's, it's a guy like he's a guy. Okay. Wait, Sorry, wait. I get a little confused by the soup. No, it's it's fine. It's uh No. Uh I actually need to shoot him a text soon and So plan weird our being next, mildly inconsiderate day, as, a, as a character, not actually I, I really being like him so far. Or, you know, just alert to everything. He's super Sounds sweet. Lovely. Kind. He's he's oh. way more outgoing than he thinks and uh way way kinder than he thinks, but uh I I'm hearing the I'm like hearing him. the subtle turns of love here. Because these are the words of someone who's really falling for someone. We haven't gone to that point yet. Well, you know, as long as you fall for somebody and settle down before the the, the state commissioner falls for the nearest steer he can find, we'll be okay. I don't, I'm pretty sure he would uh he would have sex with like a, a parking meter if he could. I, I think he would do it with a parking meter or a radar gun. Yeah. I or an actual gun. gun. Or a really tight hat. I'm pretty sure there's a reason why all of the 40 mic launchers in the state barracks are decontaminated routinely. I, I yeah. don't like thinking about him. The state police are. Nasty. They, they like their guns, and they like their freedom, and then they like their tickets, and they're a weird they bunch, like a okay? They like it a little too much. They do like it a little too much, yeah. Looks like their hats. And they're quite strange. Duh. <sighs> No, I'm, I'm happy for you, Bobby. I really am. It's nice. Well, thank you. Thank you. you know, at least it will distract people's attention from myself and Alex, which has been the talk of the law enforcement social calendar, apparently. Of course. Why, why is there drama yes. there? Oh, because the sheriff, you know, the only female one in the fucking state, has, you know, a love interest. Way, way, way. It is of most interest to everybody. Mm-hmm. That and Alex here gets shipped with whichever female he happens to ever work with, interact with, or speak to, apparently. What I can do oh, is I can yeah. start, uh, <laughs> like, dressing really sketchy and driving, like, inconspicuous cars to make it really hard for the press As to see. Opposed so to that way, whenever they do pink. get photos, it's weird. No, okay, right. I like my car. It's either that or a, or a purple elegy, so. I mean, you have to do Or my car. Thank you. Here's a caramel soy latte. Take like my other drinks. But no. Hey, it would distract people's attention, so I'm perfectly good with that, you know? That'll help. Yeah, yeah, no, I getcha. Well, we've been at this a while. Ooh, I we? can start spreading rumors. Oh, about? I can uh, send, like, a message to Weasel News from, like, a fake account saying that I'm dating, like, a ferret or something. It's like a ferret? For you. Oh, thank, thank you. you. I don't... 
to be fair, I don't think that's the proper move there to do, Bobby. No. Coffee to sugars? Not a Appreciate ferret. It. Thank you. A ferret would be a bad a literal ferret. But, you know. Just silly stuff like that. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, just oh, stay away from animals, okay? Just just leave animals off the table here and we should be good. All right, I'm not uh, not your uh, your chief deputy there. Yeah, I already have to deal with that from in-house. From more than one perspective. Because not only do I have my chief deputy, but I've discovered what my sergeants are posing for photographs with furries wearing one of their fur heads. I saw so that. It, I saw that's about community that. It's an evolving, ongoing outreach. situation. And there may or may What's not come a purge. For photos? I, this posing, then just getting, it's, 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 it's a difficult topic, okay? There's a difference between posing with the photo and having a little excitement with the photo. You know what I mean. And your chief deputy has the excitement part. Well, the chief deputy's uh, no, baton normally extends whenever too. he gets excited, so that's a problem. Mm. <laughs> God, I can't talk about this this way. I have one of the most dysfunctional departments you can possibly imagine, and I... I... Yeah. Oh, I uh, before I decided to interact with Bumblebees, um... Did I hear your former rookie put in for the sergeant's exam, Alex? Oh, uh, she did. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I told, well, it came down to her having a bad day, and I pretty much told her, look, I'm an old ass whore. By the time I even were to put in for that, uh, probably be dead. So uh, I think that she should do it and, uh, you know, be able to change what she thinks feels right i don't she's got a good heart they need to uh, have a little bit of that she does she's definitely not the yelly type and it could be interesting to see how it works you'll need to coach her a lot though i'll, well, I'll be working on that don't worry about that i know bobby it's uh i struggle to really think of a time when i wasn't command staff which some way shape or form from my lowly days as a sergeant yeah. all the way up to here i genuinely don't remember what it's like being patrol anymore i I mean, it's just you're still always been patrol, though. Well, no, you know what I mean, though. Like, just well, a regular I, I deputy, being rank and you know? file. I don't remember not that having time. to worry about big decisions and. So, yeah. so yeah, there's a difference between writing a citation and just kind of being there versus having to deal with all the back and stuff. Almost as far back as I remember, I was a, at least a sergeant. Like, <laughs> it's just hard to remember the time before that. I know it happened. It's just hard to remember. Yeah. Oh, the whole man. world shifts perspective and your view of the patrol shifts perspective when you're, you know, holding rank. It's, it's hard to explain, but, you know, you're listening We're to everybody old. else's traffic, not just your own. Because rather than waiting just for your call sign and to get a call or to be requested, you've got to think about, you know, listening to what other people are doing. Is something silly occurring? Is stupid happening? You know, is someone about to do something dangerous? Is people doing something that sounds like you should probably check on that? The only the other day we had... Uh, a deceased person who'd been stabbed passed away from exsanguination. They'd bled out. They had no pulse, so the two on scene were doing CPR on a person oh, who bled no. out. Which would have been bad enough already if they didn't still have the knife in their chest as they were doing CPR, which was just squelching more. So, you know, you have to listen out for stuff like that because... I don't know how we've gotten to this point. I really don't. I don't either. I, I don't either. The I thought, mean, a lot the of thought the, counted, the rank and file that. guys don't know much about medicine in the first yeah, place. I mean, I'll give them that. The thought counted, you know. It was a good effort. Poorly executed, but a good effort. Yeah. Then again, our own sergeants and command staff can do it too sometimes. How many times have you all shot each other? Yeah, okay, I haven't shot anybody. I haven't. Done I know a number of your blue. former I ones think, did. Uh, yeah, yeah. I think... Uh, I believe my I chief deputy, know. when he was in your command staff, just like the state I mean, lieutenant, when he was in your command staff, both shot at each other, didn't they? I was about to Intention. say, yeah I, I, yeah, I was on scene for that one. That was a fun one. And I believe the chief at the time threw they herself were... off a building. No, 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 so it, were, it was... Actually, wait, no, she was a sergeant at the time, way back when, was believe she? it or not. Oh, God. Yeah, before she got moved up, but yeah, um. she it was... 
It was both the sergeants against the lieutenant. Oh my and god. There was some sort of mis there was some sort of oh miscommunication. And all I heard up top was just bang bang bang. Only and impeding. Come to find out they, they all had gotten shot by one. Only <laughs> impeding. No offense, okay, to be it. fair, we have a generally good track record with everything else. Apart we have, was... uh... No, State's the one with citations. We, uh... No, you guys are number one in the warrants. Um... We... Respond to the most noise complaints. Yes, you do. So we got that. very good at it, too. Yeah, yeah. I will say, though, uh... Between then versus now, you have definitely improved the PD side of things. Oh yeah, PD is a lot well, better than you. it used to be. Apart from your your weirdo, what is it with our our second in commands loving animals? Okay, well mine doesn't dress up as them. He just. Oh no, you've got your second in command loves caracals, floppers. Mine wants to be a caracal or a flopper. Um, and, and, no, no, he doesn't uh, want to be. He wants to be with. Oh yeah, sorry, wants to be with one. There you go. Um, biblically. <laughs> And uh, states one wants to be biblically with sheep, so it's it's, it's complicated. Yeah, I, I feel like I got the most lucky. You, out of you did. All yeah, of he us. just wants to pet them and cuddle them and, and call them his own. He's like Lenny with the he's rabbits. Actually on a, he's on a retreat. I heard he's uh, on a, on a uh, psychic psychic yeah. retreat, learning to channel his inner flopper. He's supposed to be coming back soon, isn't he? Yeah, he's uh, two yeah weeks actually uh, with within the month, yeah. Yeah. yeah, I have missed old uh, McFlopper. He is a weird one, but he is one of us. Mm-hmm. Missed the hell so out of the guy. I keep yeah. on sending him uh, photos and, you know, all texts in our group chats and tagging him in memes and whatnot. It's like he's still with us. I feel so old sometimes, you know. People come and go, and here we you all are. You are old. Oh. She is not Shush. that old. I'm not that old, but, but she's old. Oh, Aren't on, you cradle robbing baby firefighters? Uh oh. Wait, how 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 old are we? I'm 36. Oh, I said. Yeah, well, yeah, I'm old you. Go... you. Okay, how old are you, Bobby? I'm 40. Uh huh. Oh, so okay, I'm on, the you... youngest on, one here. When's your birthday? Funny yeah, that. When's your birthday? Hold on. Are we playing? Oh, I didn't yes, mean to stand. Are. Hold on. Yes, we are playing that. When's your birthday? March 29th. Oh, you got me by a couple months in. <laughs> ah, there you go. Grandpa. No, that means you're the grandpa. <laughs> what? Oh, wait. No, so I am Okay, okay. You, okay. you, yeah. you both win at sword <laughs> fighting, okay? Point still stands that... This this job makes me feel old sometimes. Like, I feel like I've seen so much just crap. Never mind the amount of hospital trips I've been through, but... Just... There's nothing that people can do on shift that surprises me anymore. The new ways they do I it in so it does, but they, they don't seem to be able to surprise me. Are you kidding me? I have to buy a hair dye now. I got Grace coming in. I've had Grace coming in since I was 30. Thanks, Mom. <sighs> but yeah. I don't know. We'll see, I guess. It is what it is, but it's... uh. It's a weird one. I just I sometimes get this these little melancholic moments of sitting in my office going, I just I can't believe I'm still here doing this job. In this same city, dealing with the same criminals day in day out. I wonder if anything ever changes, you know. Well, I'll tell you in a uh, at most ten years I'll be retiring, so it won't be my problem anymore. I th I think it's just. Maybe this brush with mortality kind of really got to me. Because unlike all the other times where it's been a mistake on my part or someone just got the upper hand, it was random. This one has been something that's been hanging over me my entire life. A medical sword of Damocles that I didn't know about. And now I well, do. Just... It changes everything. Well, this is your sign carrying an EpiPen. Yeah, oh, I, I already am. They gave me one at the hospital and I'll be carrying one ever since. Uh, left pocket, hip. It'll always be there. But, uh, yeah. It is, uh, it's a little bit sobering, I guess. Makes me really appreciate friends like you, Bobby, and Alex. Of course, I appreciate you a great deal. And Commissioner Carson and the others and everyone, I just... 
Uh, don't Got get all sappy on us. I can't help it, okay? They gave me some painkillers that made me very sappy. I think you'll find. <laughs> okay. I don't have a concussion, all right? I'm allowed to feel sappy when I have a concussion. It's okay. You and don't I... have to worry. I know where you sleep. I sleep there, too. Yeah, I Keep know you Keep pushing do. this. <laughs> See what I put up with? Hey guys, can I have you any uh, samples? Absolutely. Oh, sure. Of course. Uh, so we have some of our gingerbread samples. Ooh, um, yes. So they're uh, one of our new the <laughs> holiday season. Lovely. Just uh, do, they're a little bit warm. I just warmed up a little bit. Oh, um, lovely. Mm, so that's good. Thank you. Mm, I like that. Yeah, can I ask you a when question? are they going to be available? Of course. Are they Wh available which, now? Which of us looks the oldest? Looks the oldest? That's a hard question, but I'd say um, I think the man in black over there. I think it's the beard. God damn it. <laughs> yep. Yep. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh, don't forget that Bobby over here is the one cradle whopping baby firefighters to try and feel young, so. He's not He's not that young. You sure? He's 27. It, it sounds like a bit of a age difference. That's 13 years, isn't it? It's a bit cradle robby. So when, when he was, um, was it nine years? Ah, he graduated high school nine years that. ago. Don't do you that. were 31 when he graduated don't, high school. Oh, that's oh, that's kind of old. Yeah. <laughs> okay, oh, I F -I -B, actually... we have him. <laughs> okay, we actually talked about it. We talked about it. He's he's okay with it. I'm okay with it. Okay, you know that thing I'm where it's sure like it's you, fine. you divide your age in half, then you add seven? I... That's literally oh. their age. Yeah, you're banging on the cusp of not being yeah. creepy. Yeah, while well, still so being creepy. I'm fine. I'm in the clear. No, I'm not creepy. It's I'm, okay. It's fine. I've, it's fine. Look, we've honestly, already been we've end. already been talking about kind of doing dinner with um, Dalton and her lawyer boyfriend because they moved in down the road from us. If you two get to a point where you are coupley, feel free to accept an open invitation to mine and Alex's for dinner, if you feel that way inclined. Well, I appreciate it. I'll have if the to commissioner can find a way to bring one of his firearms with him that he's currently sleeping with, I'm sure he will do too. I don't know. I think his luck might get jealous if he brings around like a bread or something. Yeah, it might. It could be tricky. <clears throat> he's going to start shooting each other. Mm -hmm. But no, I really it's appreciate it. Thought. I uh, I think I think this is going really well. Mm. I have really high hopes. I'm glad to hear it. You've been quiet for some time, so it's been nice to see. Yeah, I, uh, I I was actually at a point, not to, like, make the whole moment about me. Cause this, oh, it's, do, do. Thank you for, uh, I, I appreciate your recovery. Um, there was a while where I was actually considering just, uh, like, retiring early or just, you know, just not doing it anymore. Um, but uh, I spoke with uh, I spoke with the A-Chief, and he and I, like, sat down to discuss, you know, my thoughts in the future, his thoughts in the future, and uh, I don't know. I just kind of didn't do it, so I was kind of running on empty for a while, you know, kind of in this limbo between I want mm -hmm. to leave, but I don't want to leave. Um, and you know, not to sound like really, you know, weird or attached about it, but I, I feel a lot happier now, you know, talking to this guy. I'm you know, glad. It's it's it's, it's glad. nice to have something or two after work. That's nice. That's good though, and I know the feeling. Alone for far too long, and putting the work and the job first, and now here I have someone I'm going to spend the rest of my life with, and for once I'm happy. Well, as long as I don't do anything stupid. No, oh, I'm sure I'll find a way to forgive you, or I can always bury you on the beach. Oh, gee, thanks. Well, now I know where to look. <laughs> we all carry guns, <laughs> it's never going to be easy, is it? Well, I mean, no, it'll, be, it'll be easy for me to win the election. If you kill him and you get caught, <laughs> then that's that's easy. Uh, I would never get caught. Jeez, okay, really that's a little... The, the way you said that... I have access to all the forensics labs and I know exactly how to kill someone without them even having she, a clue who did it. Is, Plus, I, say, I have met most of the detectives and crime scene techs in this state. I think I'm good. I I'd be all right. I have moderate acquaintances with... Nah, I can't even say that. I am I... aware of <laughs> Dr. Bellow. Ah, uh, true, true. She and oh, I exchanged two words her. in the hallway once. Wow, okay. Really? Two words. As opposed uh, to the usual, you know, normal two, which is fuck off. That's true. Well, I have three words. Alex, take me home. 
I am. Oh well, those are four. Stud no, Forward. the Alex was not included in the three. Uh, no. Yeah, that wasn't. <laughs> it's not you, Bobby. It's just I'm starting to feel very tired. No, you're okay. You're great. <laughs> I think the hospital intended me to go home and rest, not come in and socialize and reminisce about the old times, but thanks for coming to see it's me. your idea. Thank you. I really appreciate nah, it. I, I'm here for you, both of you. You go and have a nice time with that friend of yours, and he's going to take me home and put me to bed and let me uh, sleep, and probably keep the alcohol away from me so yeah uh, i wouldn't keep it away for too long I will... yeah i would i've got yeah. a concussion just a temp walk <sighs> so well, that's a good appreciate... i'm just recovering from bruising and but and you know everything else thank I you appreciate y'all inviting me out have here. a good one y'all yeah, have a good one thing. see you next time that car is, is very raining? pink though it is oh, raining fuck. oh mm. i love my car <sighs> Alright, is it good? I, oh, no, it's not yeah, good. Yeah, it's good enough. I'm gone. Fuck it, if they're trying to do us with jaywalking, we could just tell them to go back to me. I'll write myself a ticket. I have done that before, when have I was you? new. I've never done that before. Really? I yeah, also my my meter to get out of things. You goody two-shoes. Okay, this was, I was like 24. Oh, dear. Oh my god, I'm thinking about bombshell. it now. <laughs> when I started working as a cop, uh, I was closer in age to the guy I'm talking to now than, like, currently. If that makes, that doesn't make sense, and there's but a lot to unpack I'm in just that, thinking so. about, like, oh, uh, okay, bye, I'm not gonna stop thinking about yeah. that now, that's weird. Uh, you ruined it for me. The creepy older guy dating the younger guy, and his pink uh, low rider. I guess, okay, it's okay, it's okay. Go take Mike it in. I will. Good to see you, Bobby. Don't climb any ladders! And on that note, good night. Thank you for watching, guys. A little bit of old school reminiscing on the times with uh, the Chief and with Alex. And a little bit of a slice of life. I love some slice of life RP. Yeah, it is wonderful. Time. And uh, uh, these two are perfect for each other. And maybe you'll eventually get to meet Bobby Day's new love interest, who is, by the way, played by me. I've already established them, and uh, they are gloriously androgynous. It's wonderful. Thank you for watching. Bye.